Hi fellow tubers, this is Quadcopter 101 Martini X. Uh, I just got some new toys. <laughs> Actually, I just got a new hobby. I'm back to RC again. Uh, it's been a lot of years since I done some RC, about 20 years ago. And uh, I've been watching some videos of hexcopters and quadcopters, and that looked really interesting. So I ordered myself a package that came today. The Talon Hexcopter from Turnigy, version 1. It's a hexcopter. Um, the reason I uh, ordered exactly this model is of the finish on the carbon fiber booms and uh, the centerpiece they are coated looks very good you can actually see the you can actually see the fibers in there so i, li I like the design the only thing i don't like they are very short so this makes a uh, 52 centimeters uh, all over with uh, of the hexcopters. I wanted a 80, uh, about 80 centimeters of uh, all over diameter. But these are changeable. These are actually 14 millimeters. So if some of you know where I can purchase coated uh, carbon fiber booms. 14 millimeters uh, Please comment below. I haven't been able to find them on the internet. The only carbon fiber booms I found are not coated at all I don't like those uh, This is my first video in a series of videos. I'm going to make on building two uh, Multi rotors first of all it's this one the hexcopter I'm also going to build a quadcopter very soon. Uh, I'm uh, still waiting for some packages from Hobby King with all the motors and batteries, transmitter, charger, you name it. I don't got it. <laughs> so, first of all, I'm going to uh, show the build of uh, the Turn G Talon Hexcopter. Uh, it's gonna take me a while, so I'm going to do this in a uh, time-lapse So enjoy Okay guys, this got um, kind of interesting uh, this is what you get when you don't give a shit about instruction manuals. Um, actually, the booms need to be secured by screws going through the side here. You are not able to do that once you uh, install those separation rods on the centerpiece. Uh, so we have to start all over. Well, I didn't put it uh, all in. So uh, let's try again.
Okay guys, Martini X just built his first hexacopter and it was very very interesting. It got so big, it was much bigger than I thought it was. Uh, I thought this one was going to be 52 centimeters and it's actually 63 from uh, motor center to motor center and 63 centimeters that's quite impressive she said <laughs> uh, it got a lot bigger than i thought so i'm not too sure if i'm going to rebuild this one till uh, 80 centimeter uh, i actually think this one is going to stay just like that so now i just have to wait for the kiki uh, kk 2.0 board flight controller, some Tungy 40 amp uh, speed controllers and some Tungy, uh, I thought, I think that was 790 kV uh, motors with uh, some 10 by 4.5 uh, inch propellers. Uh, building this one really gave me some uh, memories about the old days building and flying and everything and I ju it just came to me that I had this one laying around my old transmitter even has the uh, crystal 35.100 megahertz old Futaba radio now <laughs> I'm not going to use this one uh, this one is just laying around. Uh, I order a new 9 channel digital radio from Hubby King. It's coming with the first load now in a couple of days I hope. And then I'll uh, continue this video mounting all the electronics up and the programming. Uh, now I just have to figure out uh, a good way to level out the the motor mounts so they are uh, water leveled 100% uh, level with the uh, centerpiece not too sure how to do that I think I have to get myself a small water to put on them also I have to go to the hardware shop tomorrow to get myself some uh, new tools uh, to lock this off they are using some really small set screws and I don't have tools for that so I have to bring one down to the hardware store and see if they have something that small okay uh, thanks for watching uh, if you have some comments some tips or uh, some questions please um, comment down there and uh, I'll reply as soon as I can. I'll be back when uh, I get a box from Hobby King with uh, all the stuff and I'll make a new video. So thanks a lot and take care.